Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I am doing comparison of smartphones. I hope this video will help you to understand some similarities and differences of both smartphones. Friends, I would suggest to watch this video complete till the end so that you will not miss any critical information that I am going to tell you in this video. Before move on further specification, I would suggest you to hit subscribe button to get subscription of our YouTube channel. If you are watching this video from your mobile phone, then you may find bell icon just beside subscribe button. So don't forget to hit that as well. Friends, subscription to this channel is completely free. On getting subscribed to our YouTube channel, will get you update of every latest tech video once we release. Friends, you are watching Prostec. So let's get started. Friends, so starting with the OnePlus 5T device, it works on Android 7.1.1 Nougat. Oxygen OS and powered by 2.45 GHz octa-core with Qualcomm Snapdragon 835 and Adreno 540 GPU. Furthermore, what OnePlus says that Oxygen OS is their operating system built on Android. It's smooth, it's minimalistic, it's refined. Whereas Huawei Mi 10 Pro works on Android 8.0 and equipped by high silicon Kyran 970 processor with neural network processing unit that is i7 co-processor with 2.36 and 1.8 GHz octa-core and with GPU Mali G72 MP12. Moving on display, then OnePlus 5T comes in 6.01 inches with full HD optic AMOLED display having resolution 2160 by 1080 pixels with 401 ppi pixels density. OnePlus 5T is a single anodized aluminium body device, comes with 2.5D Corning Gorilla Glass 5 skin protection. Whereas Huawei Mi 10 Pro is 6 inches device with OLED full vision display having resolution 2160p by 1080 pixels and with 402 ppi pixels density. Mi 10 Pro comes with Corning Gorilla Glass skin protection and with EMUI 8.0 user interface. Talking about the internal memory, then OnePlus 5T comes with two variants that is 64 and 120 GB of onboard storage and 6 or 8 GB RAM but with no external micro SD support. OnePlus has produced this device in only two colors that is midnight black and lava red colors. Lava red color will only be available in China. It means you will not be having gold, silver or white colors options for this device. Moving on to Mate 10 Pro, it is available in with 64GB ROM and 4GB RAM and 128GB ROM with 6GB RAM and also supports microSD up to 256GB that uses SIM2 slot. Huawei has produced this device in midnight blue, titanium grey and mocha brown colors. If we talk about the dimension of OnePlus 5T, then it comes with 156.1 by 75 by 7.3 mm of thickness and 162 grams of weight with dual nano sim standby support. Whereas Huawei Mi 10 Pro is 154.2 by 74.5 by 7.9 mm of thickness weighing 178 grams with single and hybrid dual SIM support. This phone is also IP53 certified, dust and splash proof. About the camera, then a OnePlus 5T comes with 16 megapixels plus 20 megapixels Sony primary camera with 1.7 aperture, autofocus and dual LED flash, 1.6x optical zoom, geotagging, touch focus, face detection, panorama and HDR. It shoot out video of 2160p at 30 frames per seconds, 1080p at 30 and 60 frames per seconds and 720p at 30 and 120 frames per seconds. OnePlus 5T also comes with secondary Sony camera of 16 megapixels with 2.0 aperture, 1080p video recording with auto HDR. Moving on to primary camera of Huawei Mate 10 Pro. It is equipped with dual 20 megapixels and 12 megapixels primary camera with 1.6 aperture, 
ऑब्जेक्ट इमेज स्टेबिलाईजेशन बी एस आई लेजर एंड डेप्थ ऑटो फोकस टू एक्स हाइब्रिड जूम विद ड्यूल एल ई डी फ्लैश एंड विद लाइका ऑप्टिक्स टेक्नोलॉजी यू कैन ऑल्सो फाइंड जियो टैगिंग टच फोकस फेस एंड स्माइल डिटेक्शन पेनोरामा एंड एच डी आर इट शूट आउट वीडियोज ऑफ ट्वेंटी वन सिक्सटी पी एट थर्टी फ्रेम्स पर सेकेंड्स एंड टेन एट्टी पी एट थर्टी और सिक्सटी फ्रेम्स पर सेकेंड्स Huawei Mate 10 Pro also comes with secondary camera of 8 megapixels with 2.0 aperture for selfie shootouts. Friends, OnePlus 5T comes with rear mounted fingerprint scanner with accelerometer, proximity, compass, gyro, Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi direct, DLNA, hotspot, GPS, Bluetooth, NFC, fast battery charging with 5 volts dash charger and type C reversible connector. In this device what you will not find is infrared port and FM radio. This phone is equipped with a non removable 3300 mAh battery. Whereas Huawei Mate 10 Pro comes with fingerprint sensor on the back panel of the device and comes with gyroscope sensor, compass, ambient light sensor, proximity sensor hall sensor barometer and infrared remote control this phone also comes with gps bluetooth nfc wifi wifi direct fast battery charging that is 58% in 30 minutes type c reversible connector with usb host and embedded with 4000 mah non removable battery as well so that was the quick comparison of both smartphones do let us know if you have any questions and doubt of the phones in the comment section below as always do like share and subscribe the channel thanks for watching